and welcome to the session. Let's discuss the following question. The question says, solve the following inequality graphically in two-dimensional plane. x minus y is less than or equal to 2. Before solving this question, we should know that a line divides the Cartesian plane into two half planes and the graph of inequality will be one of the half planes and we shall show the solution by shading in the corresponding half plane. We shall follow the following rules to identify the half plane represented by an inequality. According to the first rule, we have to take any point AB not on the line and then we have to check whether it satisfies the inequality or not. If the point satisfies the inequality, then the inequality represents that particular half plane containing the point. But if the point does not satisfy the inequality, then the other half plane represents the solution. According to the second rule, if the sign of equality is also there with the inequality, then the line is included in the solution region and so we draw a dark line. And according to the third rule, if we have a pure inequality, then the points on the corresponding line are not to be included in the solution region and so we draw a dotted line. With the help of these three rules, we will solve this question, so always remember these rules. Let's now begin with the solution. Given inequality is x minus y is less than or equal to 2. Converting this inequality into equation, we get x minus y is equal to 2. Now we have to plot the graph of this equation. For plotting the graph, we need at least two solutions of this equation. So let's first find the two solutions of this equation. If x is equal to 0, then y is equal to minus 2. And if y is equal to 0, then x is equal to 2. The two solutions of this equation are 0 minus 2 and 2, 0. Now we will plot these two points on the graph. So let's make a graph now. The two points which we have to plot are 0 minus 2 and 2, 0. Now the first point is 0 minus 2. This means when f c is 0, then ordinate is minus 2. So this is the required point 0 minus 2. Second point is 2, 0. This means when ordinate is 0, then f c is 2. So this is the required point 2, 0. Now by the second rule, we know that if sign of equality is also there with the inequality, then the line is included in the solution region and so we draw a dark line. Now in this question, we have x minus y is less than or equal to 2. Now the sign of equality is there, so this means we will join these two points by a dark line and this line will be included in the solution region. So let's now join these two points. This line is representing the equation x minus y is equal to 2. This line divides the plane into two half planes that is 1 and 2. Now we have to identify the half plane represented by an inequality. According to the first rule, we have to select a point which does not lie on the line and then we have to check whether it satisfies the inequality or not. If this point satisfies the inequality, then the inequality represents that particular half plane containing the point. But if the point does not satisfy the inequality, then the other half plane, that means the half plane which does not contain the point, represents the given inequality. As the point 0, 0 does not lie on this line, so we can take the point as 0, 0. Now substitute x as 0 and y as 0 in the given inequality. By substituting, we get 0 less than or equal to 2, which is true. Hence, the half plane 
containing zero zero represents the inequality. x minus y is less than or equal to 2. Now let's look at the graph. Now the first half plane contains the point 0, 0 and since we have an equal to sign in the given inequality, so this means this line is also included in the solution region. So the solution region of the given inequality consists of first half plane and this line. Let's now shade this region. This is the required solution region. So, the shade Half plane including the line is the required graphical solution. This is our required answer. So this completes session. Hi, enjoy.